Hey everybody, and welcome back to another episode of Let's Play Okami. Well, we're, uh, we're in the Emperor's body. I guess we gotta keep going. Is this the exit, or is this further in? Wonder what's in there. I have a feeling we're in for trouble. You're not gonna turn back now, are you, Ami? No way. Oh, is this a boss? Did we stop right before a boss? Good answer. Okay, you know the drill. Leap before you think. Well, we saved, so, you know, we're good. Oh, it, it straight up is a boss, I think. Oh, good. This is a great way to um, return to the game after not playing it for a while. Because I do not remember how to play. Oh, yeah, that's a, that's a boss arena if I ever saw one. That's a sword. Huh? Is that like a cursed evil sword? No way. This is insane. That mist. It's alive on me. It is coming from the sword. Oh, hello. You look angry. Polite. Under my control, this body breathes evil mist over the city. And you, Mutt, you dare attempt to clear the skies of my poison? Waging battle with me inside a human body will be no easy task. Even now, Goldnail, the mighty sword, cries out for your blood. Come, step forward so that I... The indomitable blight may cut you down. Okay then. Yes, son. <laughs> I'll step forward, all right. You're a real piece of work, blight. Better say your prayers. You uncultured wretch. Ooh, we might have to help him. Be warned. We are in the very bowels of the Emperor. If we fight here, his body will not... Give me a break. A little action here will help him wake up. But never mind that. You're the one behind that poison mist. Possessing a human body may be an elaborate trick. It ends now. With my supreme blade, Denkomaru, I, the magnificent Isen, shall render a rend that hunk of junk you call sword. All right, here we go. So what's the gimmick here? Ow! Ah. I see. Time slow? Okay. Still can't hurt him, though. Oh, okay. Woohoo! about to like zoom aha and then you attack him while he's oh wait can I can I pee on you <laughs> I peed on the sword <laughs> okay wait maybe I can like gale it away no okay that's exactly what you do gonna like oh, what is he gonna do Okay. Gonna be the sword shot. That's fine. Yep. Oh, come on. Okay. Yep. Oh, dang it. I waited a little too long. There we go. Come on. I guess, like, just every time he bends over. Oh, okay. Dang it. I keep, like, missing. 
really annoying, actually. Come on! Game! Okay. Now we attack. Oh. We, like, broke it. What, what happened there? Did we get hurt? Or did I gain a godhood? What was that? Okay. I think that's a attack. Dang it. That's a sword. Whee! Okay. Dang it. I mean, we do damage every time that we... Uh... Hit. There we go. And I think that's the end of it. That was a really easy boss. That can't be... Th there's got to be a second form, right? Oh no, we just break the sword. Okay. Is that really it? Ooh, what is that? Rosaries? I like rosaries. I'll use that. You obtained Divine Instrument Exorcism Beads. Ooh, purifying rosary that contains the power of holy light. Blight, a disease residing within the Emperor's body and born of the intense hatred and evil of the cursed sword Goldnail, was the source of the acrid mist that had plagued the capital's citizenry. But even a creature so despicable and full of hatred was no match for our intrepid heroes Amaterasu and Isun. Blight's defeat brought with it a lifting of the acrid fog. The Emperor, now freed of evil's influence, Return to normal. Amaterasu and the others had earned a brief moment of respite. However, evil conspired to cut the tranquil scene short. From Goldnail's defeat, form, defeated form rose the familiar blackness, the spirit of evil and hatred that had resided within the sword. Black as midnight and deep as the sea rose slowly skyward. Make no mistake, this was undoubtedly one of the foul spirits that dispersed from Orochi's broken body. Quickly and steadily, it rose. Then it shot off toward the distant sea and over the horizon. It moved with the purpose, as if to, ro to a rendezvous with a lost friend. Amaterasu and the others had no time to rest. If they were truly to restore the capital to its normal routine, they still had to deal with the threat the water dragon. This tale is far from over. Hey you, aren't you forgetting something? You had it coming, big time, gas bag. You weren't even in the same league as the magnificent Isun. Wolferball? That's that. How about one of those victory owls? Oh wait, I almost forgot. That babe Kaguya is still locked up. We're also inside of a body. I mean, seems Pops is still snoozing away. How about we just take control and make him unlock her cell? We can do that. Why bother with waking him up to explain everything, anyway? Huh? You don't get it, do you? Watch and learn, my furry friend. First, I'll stir up his stomach like this, and then... What the? Yikes! What is happening? What the? Hey, are you okay, Ami? Looks like we managed to make the Emperor stand up. Come on, we gotta get this royal oaf moving. Let's get him over to where they're holding Kaguya. Back. I guess this controlling humans business is harder than it looks. We gotta get Big Shot over there to Kaguya's cell, not this way. Okay, let's head for her cell now. Oh, I see. I just went the wrong way. 
I guess I can't go in and here and explore or something? Oh, I can explore a tiny bit, but there's... Like, I can't interact with anything, but so it doesn't really matter. Your Highness, you're well enough to walk around again? That Kaguya girl was in prison just as you ordered, sire. But she's done no wrong, so I can't understand why. Or, um, not that I'm doubting your bountiful wisdom, Your Highness. That dude's like, what is happening? Your Highness, I know you have already refused to see a doctor, but surely it would be wise to seek treatment. Some people are even starting to say your illness is what's... Um, not that... And I think I do think of the sort, of course. Of course you don't. Are you the Emperor? But if you're here, does that mean the two are... Oh dear, it's all my fault. How shall I ever apologize? Hmm, let's see. How about you start off by making me 100 dumplings? Huh? <laughs> Just pulling your leg, sweetie. That voice. You think we'd buy the farm that easy? The Emperor was being controlled by a nasty stomach virus. Oh, jeez. But we took care of it. Things should get back to normal soon. Now, let's make this royal oaf open your cell. Let's see. Oh, thank you. I thought I'd never get out of there. No time for chit-chat, bamboo girl. We freed the Emperor from that monster controlling him. Things are still a bit dicey around here. We're gonna hightail it out of this place. I suggest you do too. Now let's see here. Oh yeah. Coochie coochie coo! <laughs> I can tell what you want to do, Ami. I agree. That'll make it feel like we've set things straight here. I mean, we're already freed that bamboo girl. Now, give one of those victory howls to wake up the Emperor. Oh, time was bad. Whatever, who cares? Ooh, got an achievement. Do I have to save the game? Sure. Hmm, I wonder what was wrong with me. People say I took to my bed with an illness, but I don't recall. I remember meeting with a bamboo seller called Kaguya, and then I remember a secret treasure for crossing the Sea of Fire, but I've totally lost my memory of what happened after that. It's almost like I was possessed by a strange spirit. Ah, uh, talk about a troublesome emperor. But Kaguya's safe and all. I guess we could cut him some slack. A white wolf and a curious bouncing ball. I have an uncanny feeling that I had a dream about you two. Must apologize to Queen Himiko for my unforgivable blunders. Himiko? Yes, that's it, Ami. This city's a complete mess, and Queen Himiko's not doing a thing about it. There's no excuse for her just sitting around in her palace. Boy, am I gonna give her a piece of my mind. Ah, the lovely white wolf. For some reason, I feel so relaxed when you're around. I have this peaceful feeling as if you know me inside out. Well, I know you're from the inside, believe me. I'm collecting demon fangs, you know. If you have any for me, you can take some of my treasure. Ooh. People will probably say I'm foolish giving treasure to a wolf, but you're my lucky wolf. I'm certain some good will come of it. Surely you've collected lots of them, huh? What do you think? Would you like to take a, make a swap? Yes, please. Fog pot. Marked with a mist crest allows transfer between origin mirrors. Ooh, that's interesting. Okay, can I get... I can't get all of them. Golden ink pot. Ink pot with... Increases ink restoration speed. Draw a line connecting Issun to an enemy to steal items. Oh, that's good. Okay, so I'm assuming fog pot is necessary, but <sighs> like I need both of them, but I can't afford both of them. Really want that though. 
Need to come back. I... I guess this, because this is going to allow us to go to any save point, be a lot faster to travel. Yeah. Thank you. Oh! Ah, Amaterasu, origin of all that is good and mother to us all. Our separation had weakened me. My power had scattered like the mist. Your heart, pure enough to pierce the darkness, reawakened me. The seal of mist will protect you. My power has reached its peak. I hereby bestow upon you the power of mist warp. Whoa, never expected something like that from a flask. Bet that royal elf didn't even know what was in this thing. Now about mist warp, I don't exactly know how to use it. But the important thing is you got another technique back. So this is a, is this a secret technique or something? I don't know. Got Veil of Mist tech. Scroll drawn by the artist. Cool. Grab this real quick. Yay. Nothing else out here. We will get more demon fangs because I definitely want that thing. Um, oh, nope. That's the wrong button. Do we have to equip? Uh, no. Okay, so it's not an item left for those two. Um, want this as our main weapon. We don't have any gold powder, do we? We do not, but that's fine. We have so much stuff. Yeah, a lot of these are perfect for drawing. Okay. Alright, uh, let's see if the Emperor has anything. If you look closely, do me fancy things to differ slightly. I'd like to collect each and every one of them if I could. Do you want to swap yours for some treasure? Okay, that's all you have. Come back for those. Definitely want them. Come visit me again when you have more demon fangs to swap. Sure thing, Emperor. Let's see what else is around here. Oh, there's treasure. Oh my god, are you kidding me? There it is. Easy to miss. Anything else around here? Oh my god, there's treasure buried everywhere in the palace. Okay. Weird, I just like wasn't standing in the right spot. Still? Else? Oh, this is the place we were going through before. That poisonous air has disappeared as soon as the Emperor got better. Maybe it had something to do with whatever was possessing it. Anyway, I hope everyone else recovers from the illness, too. Oh, yeah. Yeah, this is straight up where we were. That's pretty cool to see. That whole area contained in one little thing. Anything else around? I don't think so, but we can check real quick. Emperor is back to his usual gentle self again. It seems he was possessed by some kind of malevolent force. I'm worried about the strange air over Nippon. Hoping it isn't headed for Saiyan City, too. Yeah. There. Really? That's all that's here? Okay. Well, then, we can officially leave. Oh, nope. More treasure to be had. Just stealing stuff all over the place. I mean, seriously, look at this. It's a bountiful. I'm gonna get so much money after all this. And spend it all on one thing of gold dust. This almost looks like it should be a uh, a mermaid coin area. But it's not. Okay. Now I think we're finally done. Hey there, Wolf. So you up? Snuck into the palace then. I had a feeling that you were in there, but I turned a blind eye. 
It's almost like I knew that some good would come of it. Not exactly sure what happened, but I know that the Emperor is back to his usual gentle self. Oh yes, that girl Kaguyo has been at release safe and sound too. She came running outside earlier, looking happy as can be. Well, that's good. Well, if it isn't the White Wolf coming out of the palace, that means you must have snuck in your, your way in somehow. You did well, thank you. Dang right. Okay. And all the poison's gone as well. It means I think all the curse zones are gone, so now we can check out the uh, city properly. Hey, a bamboo girl. What are you doing spacing out there? I mean, you're free now. You can go wherever you want. Oh, hello, you two. I hardly recognize you. You were so tiny when we first met. You certainly cut a dashing figure at full size. You think so? Well, actually, I hear stuff like that all the time. Huh? Oh, yes, I met you too, Winston. Anyway, the city is a dangerous place right now. You should head back to your grandpa's house. That emperor fellow's got an eye out for that treasure of yours, right? You should get away before others start sniffing around. Plus, your grandpa seems awfully lonely, you know. Really? Oh, I see. That dear old man thinks of me as his own granddaughter. I would really like to return, but... You're not his granddaughter? You mean your real family lives somewhere else? Aw, anyway. You should just go see him if you feel that way. I know nothing of my past. I don't even know who I am or where I came from. My first memory of waking up in a bamboo grove. The bamboo cutter took me home where I was lovingly cared for. To repay his kindness, I helped him with his bamboo wear. If that's the case, then why don't you hurry up and go see him? I know nothing of my past, but I do recall one faint memory. God, just tell me. I felt long and hard while I was imprisoned. It was then I remember being in a small dark room long ago. That's all I can think about now. And... I feel I must get there as soon as I can. I can escape. I cannot escape that feeling. Hmm, that's a pretty weird story. I mean, don't, you don't even know where it is you want to go back to. Bits and pieces of my memory are coming back in flashes. Together, they form a vision. I see a royal crest inscribed in earth amid a grove of bamboo. I, hmm, I must go to Sasa's sanctuary. Yeah, I was about to say. There, it shall be all become clear. Okay. Yes, I know where that is, game. I've been there. Huh? What's gotten into you? I mean, first with the dark room, and now you suddenly want to go to Sasa Sanctuary? I don't know where I must return, but I have this intense feeling in my heart. It drives me forward to my ultimate destination. It drives me to seek the royal crest. I must leave for Sasa Sanctuary at once. Okay, so... We were planning to go back anyway, because I gotta go see the tree for Sakuya and pick up some other things, so that's good. Oh, she's gone. Okay. Let's check out these areas that I could not look at before. For all the space over here. This is like prime real estate for where they would hide something. Because it's like, why would you ever check here? Uh, unless there's actually nothing. Oh, is there just nothing? No way. Okay. Mermaid coin area. Interesting and good to know, but... Aha! I was wondering if there was going to be something. This will give us a bloom. Some extra praise. Can we level up yet? I don't think so, but... We can get some more health. I don't know if it's worth it. Give a bigger purse soon. Yeah, maybe we'll just get a bigger purse soon. Oh. Uh, no, I want it to be daytime for now. I mean, I know... Well... I know other stuff happens at night. But... I don't know. Oh, right. We can now fish, can't we? Hmm? Hey, Hoodhead. What you up to here? Oh. You are just in time to witness history in the making. I finally realize how empty the life of a sword collector is. Now I am hooked on the thrill of fishing. May not join me in my newfound passion. Sure, we can fish. Oh, why not? We could afford to kill a little time. Let's psych ourselves up, Ami. Yeah, so we can fish now. There's a lot of fishing you can do here. There's a lot of new fish in Saiyan City. You got the basic idea, right? Draw a line from pole to fish. Let's get you a big one. Actually... We want to catch all the small ones first. Mm. 
Come on, fish. I don't know what that is. I think it's something we already got. Killifish. Oh, that's not new. Let's continue fishing. Uh, still want the smaller fish. Because if you go for the bigger fish, then the... Like, it's only bigger fish. Oh, the crab. Do I have a crab? River crab. I think I do. What's the one I don't have? A sea bass or something? Oh no, catfish is the one I couldn't get. That one only appears at night. That's why I didn't get it uh, in the forest. So, this will also give us a lot of money, too, which we definitely want. But we're going to need money, so, you know. We're going to need a ton of money if I'm going to try and get any more of those uh, upgrades from the dojo. We definitely want... What? What? What was that game? I drew something in the water, apparently. I didn't even know that was possible. This is something we've definitely gotten before. It's a goby or something? Yeah. I think there's only like a few new fish in Saiyan City, so it may not be worth it to keep fishing, but there definitely are a few. That looks new. Is this new? Boach. Yeah, we definitely haven't caught that before. That's new. Oh, medium sized fish only now. Um, I'm gonna keep going for a little bit, and I'll come back if there's any more unique fish that I get. Um, yeah, we'll see. Black bass. Ooh. Ooh, this is definitely a new one. Oh my god, it's huge. Giant catfish. Wow. Okay then. Ooh, what's this? Boy. Ooh, that's new. Ooh, I think we got another new one. Sturgeon. Okay. So, I believe I've caught all of the fish so far that uh, appear during the day. And the only way that I can get any of the others is to turn at nighttime. I thought we talked to him at night, but apparently not. Maybe it turned day? I, I don't quite understand. Um... But there's, there are some fish that only appear at night. You've discovered my reason for a living. Cool. Good for you. Um, turn it nighttime. Nighttime. There we go. And hopefully if we start fishing like right at the beginning of night. Oop. Sorry. Yes. Join you for fishing. Sure. There are some fish that only appear at night that we want to try and get. Um, so there's a small fish and so two small fish, one medium and one. So two small, two medium. Okay. Let's hope we get them. Okay, we got one of them. Smelt. This only appears at night. Hopefully we can get the others as well. I think we're moving on to medium fish at this point. Okay, we got another one. Freshwater eel. It's brand new. Okay. There's only two more, I believe. So hopefully we get them. 
Okay, so we'll still have to do some fishing because I definitely haven't caught everything. <clears throat> but, I, I mean, like, I wanted to move on eventually. I wasn't going to stay here the whole time. That being said, um, there are a few fish that only appear at nighttime that I haven't caught. Well, two of them, really. Um, but one is in Taka Pass, so I might try doing that. If I am unable to fish in Taka Pass still, then... That may just be something that, like, one day I catch. Alright, there's both of your trees bloomed. You guys have anything to say about the trees bloom? Have you heard the news, Pooch? It seems that the Emperor has gotten over his illness at last. He's back to his gentle old self. Thank goodness. Can't tell you how relieved I am. Yeah, I bet. Okay. The tree's all good here. Wait, are there trees that I haven't been blooming? I can bloom all the stuff in the city now, too. But, like... Oh, God, yeah, I've been walking past this stuff. Haven't I? Yep, all this can be fixed now. Ah, that's what's over here. Just trees, trees to be bloomed. That not work? Game? Am I not close enough? That's not... Okay. There it is. Okay. And finally get that upgraded. Uh, wallet, if I wanted to. Get this last tree over here. Hello? There it is. Doesn't give us a lot of praise, but every little bit helps. And I believe that it all goes toward, um... The extra quest of just blooming this place in general. I believe there is one. Still think they won't let us go into the palace, I believe. You're a persistent one, aren't you, Mutt? For whatever reason, the curse seems so has dissipated. There's still a sinister presence on the Ryoshima coast, though. We won't let it, let it lay a finger on Queen Himiko. No, we guards won't let any evil get the better of us. Bah, Himiko's people all sound like a bunch of parrots. Maybe they can stand up to the evil of those monsters, but I bet they are no match for the brush techniques of the gods. Huh. You need a brush technique to get past them? Oh. You just literally slow down time to get past them. Okay. Well, you know, if that's the case, let's do all the stuff that's required of us here. Is there nothing back here? There's gotta be something back here. Aha! Gray bead. Okay. Goodies for me. Okay. Nothing else? Rock isn't. Rock is not impervious? No, rock was not impervious. These trees seem fine, interestingly enough. I wonder why that is. Can I... I, can't, I don't think I can bloom from here. I need to do it from the other side. We'll get to that in a second. Ooh, there's like doors. Oh, we could go in here? What is this? I don't remember this area whatsoever. A koto and a shamisen. What an elegant room, but it looks like it's just used for storage now. Ooh, you know what? Their storage is my goodies. Okay, I guess that's it. Alright. Just an extra little 
treasure chest room. With a chest that doesn't look like any other treasure chest in the game, I might add. Oh, bizarre. Ooh, what's this area for? Probably nothing story related whatsoever. Thing of water here. Big open sea. And interestingly, little arch over there. I wonder what that'll be used for. Holy bone. Probably just some more. Oh, yep. That looked bigger than normal. That little green thing. Anything else here? Oh! A bunch of stuff here. Ah, a bunch of northern land. Girl drawn by wandering artist. I wonder what I just picked up. Okay. Bang. What is over here? Oh, okay. Looks no bigger than normal. Breaking your pots, getting your money. Alright. Let's go see the queen then. That really? Can't go through it? Oh! Let's go steal the queen's stuff first. That was bizarre. Oh, it's a Zodiac treasure. A special one. There's only 13 of them, apparently. Okay. Now we're ready. Hmm. Why? It really is you. Her Majesty Queen Himiko is for senior coming. You must not delay, please. Queen Himiko awaits on the top floor. Himiko's waiting for us? If you're really the ones Queen Himiko has been looking for, even a boiling sea of flames won't stand in your way, will it? Sea of flames, huh? Boy, that sounds great. Like something I definitely want to be a part of. Great bead. Alright, let's head up. Elevators. Who knew they existed way back when? <laughs> Does that mean there's somebody, like, waiting just to pull this? Because, like, surely this is not an elevator that's used a whole lot. Oh. What the what? What's all this lava doing here? Maybe a god now, but you'd end up a crystal critter if you fell in this stuff. And Himiko's sure making things difficult. You must really have a good reason for wanting to keep people away. Well... There is nothing we can do about lava just yet. So, we will come back. Yeah. Can't do anything here yet. Alright. Uh, yeah, let's just finish getting all the trees done, and then we will make our way toward Sasa Sanctuary. I think I want to make a detour and have us go to, uh, the village? Hey, how did you get in your mutt? This is terrible. How did you get past our foolproof defense? How could we let Queen Himiko down like this? Her, get out of your butt. Yeah, that's what I'm doing. Anyway, you guys are terrible at your job. Uh, ooh. Here's a question. Nope. Not what I was trying to do. Can you please bloom the trees? Thank you. I know I don't draw the best circles, but like, they're, they're fine circles. There it is. It's not like you can't tell it's a circle. Whatever. Come on. Like, they, they are circles, game. There we go. It likes, like, egg shapes better than it does horizontal. 
Anything's buried here? It doesn't look like it. Okay. Is that all the trees in this area? Because, of course, we couldn't really travel through this place before. That's right, there's a cat statue on the back there. We'll have to come back here when we know cat. The cat thing. I truly don't remember what the cat thing is. I mean, I know it lets you climb, but where to get it and all that? No idea. I think it's a story thing, but I could be wrong. Oh, this is like a barracks. Well, that's a scrolls. Well, I'm just going to take this. Not a barracks, like a record room. Hey there, doggy. What brings you to a dull old place like this? Just the guard room for Queen Himiko's palace. There's nothing that here that would be of interest to you. Well, I mean, the treasure I took was. I have no excuse. I was totally off my guard and unprepared. It's unthinkable that we were cursed at a time like this. I feel so humiliated. I've brought shame upon my whole family. I must devote myself to guard duty more than ever to make amends. Okay, then. People are saying that this place was under some kind of curse. It was like I was having an awful nightmare the whole time. It was horrible. The Ryoshima coast was engulfed in evil. I'm petrified just thinking about it. I just have to keep telling myself it was all a bad dream. It was not. We're good there. Is there anything behind this place? There is. Look at that. Goodies for me. For me. Thing on the other side. Oh, there's something buried on the other side. We're going to sell all this stuff in a minute. And we're going to sell all the fish, too. We're about to make a boatload of money. Oh. Okay. Huh. Well, we can't get that out just yet, I don't think. Right? Yeah, I think we need an ability to get the those out of the water. White Wolf, although the smiles have returned to people's faces, it does not mean that plane has been abolished from our world. I will rest now for my travels. Here I will recite my holy chants. For the living who are in pain and the dead who have suffered, our paths may be different, but our principles are the same. May the enlightenment of Buddha await you. Oh, is he done? Did we really complete his little side quest? I don't think so, but... Hey, whatever. Infinity Stone. Okay. Oh, okay. Oh. I could have... If I was smart, I could have uh, double jumped across. There was no reason. I just forgot I had double jump. Okay. So you technically have a triple jump if you also attack. It moves you forward. Alright, we need to go into that person's house as well, because they have some trees to bloom. Oh, right, the kid. In the ocean swims a mighty... Oh, right. The song my grandma taught me. Apparently the water dragon is causing the sea. Okay, yeah. Oh, water dragon. We'll deal with that eventually. I think that's the last thing we do in this chapter. I don't remember. In any case, I just want these trees bloomed. Because these are the people that are mean to me. Can you just... Please? There we go. There it is. Are you finding my mansion nice and comfortable, dog? I don't have anything for you, but you can stay as long as... Oh, wow, they don't even say anything different. Alright, out of sheer curiosity, is it worth it to... Yeah, well, the next upgrade isn't until a long time. But that gets us set up if we get a bunch of money. Astro Pouch, I believe, only has the one upgrade? Remember. No, we'll just go for more health, I guess. Health and... Think. We're pretty well off, like, 
We don't really need more upgrades, but the more praise you get, the uh, more you can upgrade everything, so why not? Alright. Um, yeah, I think that's everything back here. Does Rao have anything new to say to us? Have you noticed that the mist over the city has suddenly disappeared? There must have been some change in the Emperor. Well, we'll take credit for that, thank you very much. Hey, wait. What about you, sister? Why didn't you try to help the Emperor? Couldn't your mystical powers have located the source of that mist? I knew it! You and Himiko are up to no good! That... that was my mistake. But I'm just a priestess, you know? I can... I can't go snooping around the Imperial Palace for no reason. Anyway, if you cured up the mist, then I offer you my congratulations. So then, now that's resolved, it's on to the next problem. All of what you've done so far is amazing. However, the water dragon is a much bigger problem. No trading ships can get through, the city's food is running low, and the be evil besieging our fair land still looms large in the shadows. Now is exactly the time we need them. If only we had the fox rods. Yeah, we still need to find those. Yeah, and now... We can... Well, we can save on these, but we can also... Uh, use it to... Travel? How do you do this? Oh, wrong button. We have a technique scroll, right? Is that what we got? Um, not through there. Move list? Book? Nope. Huh. Do we just do this over it? Like while it's... Nope. I don't know how to use that technique. But that's an origin mirror, so we should be able to fast travel using it. As long as we do it via the technique. Alright, a bunch of people waiting in line. Suckers, I didn't have to wait in line. Because I'm awesome. Look at that bright blue sky. Alright, let's go fix the rest of the city. I'm sure they're going to be real happy. And sell a bunch of stuff. We're going to make a ton of money here. Sweet! The cursed zone vanished along with that funky mist. Looks like the city's come back to life. Ami, bet you never saw a happening place like this a hundred years ago. This must have been exciting for you, being from the country and all. Now I know you just want to have fun, but don't go overboard. I mean, I want I don't want you to forget what you're supposed to be doing. Yeah, because the game really like opens up with what you can do here now. Does that need a bloom? Ah, I feel so refreshed. I realized something that when that gloomy mist went away. Suddenly, I felt so much better again. Now oh, I can enjoy fulfilling my ambition at last. Don't you know who I am, Mutt? My name is Masu. I'm a warrior traveling the land to perfect my martial arts. Okay. The truth is, there are some monsters I just have to defeat. I have a list of all of them in a special manifest. I call them the Monster Manifest. They all deserve what's coming. And I finally managed to defeat all of them. And I can stand proud and tall as a true warrior. Okay. What is it, Mutt? Do you want to see my monster manifest? I'm afraid that's not possible. It contains the names of the most vicious monsters out there. The likes of you would probably faint just from looking at it. Excuse me? Even if I had a few drinks at night and relaxed my guard, I'd never let this manifest out of my sight and show it to us all. Okay. A few drinks at night, huh? Yes. Oh, excuse me? That's right, you can't hit me. Alright, there's a bar over here. That looks nice. And there's a lot of places to look at. Little deck over here. Oh dear lord, there's so much to do. Can I bloom the trees? I can bloom the trees. Is 
that bloom two of them? No. I need to, like, get over there to actually bloom them better. Oh, that worked. So let's check out the bar. I don't want to do too, too much. Because I'm, I'm going to get ahead of myself. Die, the afternoon is so relaxing. I mean, everything's all ready. Now all I have to do is wait for the customers. Yeah, customers at night. Oh, hello. Hello there, pup. You look like someone who appreciates fine cuisine. Proper diet is the key to life. Eat well and be healthy. I'm Yama, top shelf in Cyan City. Pleased to meet you. Okay. Fire Chef Yama. What do you think about this huge pot on the giant stove? Impressive, eh? I invested every yen t to my name into him. Now, I had to get something special. I had to get him special order for what I'm aiming to do. Ever heard of the tale about that mushroom? There's not a single chef in the world who doesn't know about it. Talking about the legendary golden mushroom. I spent decades trying to master the culinary arts, but I've yet to make a dish that truly satisfies me. If only I could get my paws on one of those golden mushrooms. I'm sure I could prove my true skill by making the ultimate dish. I already have this huge pot and giant stove. All I need is a golden mushroom. Then I master the art of cooking. That is my dream. I have one. Could it be? Is that... Is that the legendary golden mushroom? That sparkling gold color, the captivating shape. Yes, there could be no doubt. Where in the world did you find it, pup? Oh, never mind that. Uh, with that mushroom, I could fill my dream. My dream, a master of the art of cooking. Please, please, pup. I must have that mushroom. What could a dog do with it anyway? All right, here you go. Really? Oh, thank you. You're such a good pup. With this golden mushroom, I will attempt to make the ultimate dish. My long cherished dream will finally be fulfilled. Okay. Hmm? Oh, yes, the ultimate dish. I was overwhelmed by emotion when the legendary golden mushroom came into my paws. Not a day had passed without my preparing this huge pot and giant stove for this day, and now the time has come. I shall wait no more, pup. Today, the fiery chef Yama will prepare the ultimate dish. Now watch carefully, pup. You may learn a thing or two. Behold, Yama's super deluxe fan the flames dance! Or I think I'm supposed to fire, do fire on it? You didn't put it on fire. What? What? Pot's not getting hot enough for the ultimate dish. I fanned so hard, but it didn't even come to a boil. Maybe I didn't stir up enough air? I think you're going to wonder about this guy. Hey, what's up with that thing back there? Is that the mark of Moagami, the god of Inferno, drawn on it? Did he put that there thinking he could harness the power of Inferno to heat up that huge pot? Did he really expect the gods to answer his selfish prayers? Ah, I see. It's an infinity. I'll try it again right there, right now. Today, the fiery chef Yama will prepare the ultimate dish. Now watch carefully, pup. You may learn a thing or two. All right. I can't just fan a flame that doesn't exist yet. What? Nope. Whoa, can I not do it yet? I should I look this up, I guess? What the heck? It was supposed to do it. Let's try it one more time. It was seriously supposed to do it, and we're supposed to get, like, a secret technique here because of it. I don't know why it wasn't doing it for us. Okay, now it worked. There we go. Ah, uh, Amaterasu, origin of all that is good and mother to us all. My power had diminished while you were away, but that man's zeal and your own pure heart have restored my power. I have harnessed his fervor and energy to bestow upon you a new power. Unleash your wrath in a mighty fire burst. So now we can finally finish off the ice wheels properly, because we can create fire. I did it! My long cherished dis, I give you race to eruption! Well, what do you think, pup? Pretty impressive, huh? Okay. 50 praise along with it, huh? Not bad, but we can't tell how it tastes just by looking at it. Enough about that. Never thought you'd get the power of Moagami here, Ami. Remember that mark on the wall? 
Draw that, and you can invoke the power of Inferno anytime you want. Use it to reduce those mean old monsters to ashes. <laughs> they won't know what hit them. Consumed rice stew. There's a bunch of rice stew there. Ooh, and another goodie. Look at all the goodies. Inferno tech. Oh, that's right. You can get the technique and then just walk out without actually having it. All right. I think we're all done here. Um, I'm going to make a beeline and sell some things, and we can check out the rest of the city next time, because we are sort of running out of time a little bit. Um, and there's a lot to check out here. We need to get him drunk at night. There's a bunch of trees we need to fix. This one. Yeah, I guess I can fix some of the trees on my way. Oh, that one's still cursed. Wait, can I, like, blow it away? Nope. Can I... Build wallets. Nope. So some of them are still cursed, and we can't fix the cursed ones. We can fix the others, though. But the cursed trees remain. I believe there is a way that we can fix that. I don't remember how off the top of my head. Oh, look at all these cherry blossoms. Hold on. Can I just get them all? Get a bunch of them? I got all three. Ha ha ha. What about these? Yeah, look at that. Okay. There's that. Are you the fish salesman? Tool dealer. Oh, there's the mist gone. There's a lot more people coming and going. The water in the canal is clean again, too. Maybe now the fish from Lake Biwa will come back. That means there will probably be people fishing here again. There will always be delicious fish over in the uh, aristotic quarter. I bet there's already people fishing over there again over there. I don't have much in stock thanks to the water dragon, but business is business. I like to sell what I have. And send out to buy something? Yes, let's do some of this. But first off, sell all these fish. Hopefully I get a good amount for all this. I got a lot. Ooh, that was a good one. Ooh, yeah. Fish, man. I'm telling you. The market. Bunch of treasures, too. Oops. Ooh, three bullhorns, huh? I had four pearls! Bam! Well... We can buy a secret technique or two. That's nice. Uh, nothing else to buy from him, so that's good. We're gonna get more money, too. I mean, I am gonna go back and do more fishing. We're not done with that. One thing I do think I'm gonna do real quick. This guy. When the Mr. Spear, the curse zone, vanished with it. Everyone here in Sayan is thrilled. Anyway, business is slow, so to say the least. Have you been sent to do the shopping again? Yes. Uh, right, he has seven strike. Ooh, we need to get that, but we also need gold dust. You have you have two. That's what I thought. Okay. Well, I'll do more fishing off screen. Get all that money back. Uh, but what we're gonna do? Oops. We're gonna upgrade the things that we have. So tools, gold dust, I power up exorcism beads. Then we power up 7 Strike. Now we haven't used uh, the beads just yet in a fight, so I'll keep those on us, and then we'll switch to the 7 Strike after we get a chance to use that. So I think that's everything that we can do just yet without starting the quests for other things. Okay! Uh, next time, we will continue to go through all of this. Oh, right. Can I... Hold on. Can I light the braziers? I can. And now that the braziers are lit... Oh, yeah. You can, like... There's a whole thing you can do. There's a whole path you can make with them. And now the main one... Is lit. That's a whole thing to do, too. Okay, we'll do that next time as well. Anyways. 
for now. Um, we will take a little break and see you guys next time. Thank you all for watching. See you all then. Bye-bye.